Hey, I'm hungry. How much time till we get there? I'm hungry too. Uh, we will arrive in five minutes. Welcome to 93.53 BC Center News. Unemployment has risen by 40% since last year due to an advancement in technology taking over jobs. Another school in Beit Hanina has closed down due to a lack in government funding. City Hall Junction shut down due to solar energy protest. We have arrived at our destination. There's no parking spot. No, look, there's one right there. We are pushing green, a company aimed to revolutionize cities to become more sustainable for the future. We conducted a series of interviews with different individuals regarding the problem of solar panel placement. We interviewed a social activist and a student coordinator from MEET, which both emphasized the importance of solar panels on the roofs in their communities. Also, our chief engineer fortified how efficient solar panels are when on roofs. Moreover, the public is firmly protesting for panels on the roof. Right here. <laughs> you see that? This. This is why our company will revolutionize sustainable cities without taking care of any useful space. Well then, why not just put the solar panels on the roof? Why put the solar panels on the roof when you have a lot of empty, unused uh, space in deserts which we can exploit? Exactly. The idea of placing portions of solar panels on a remote location like the desert is extremely space and cost efficient. Especially for those who do not have the space nor money to put solar panels on the roof. Additionally, as our chief engineer has once said, putting solar panels in the desert will make them more efficient and they will produce more energy because the sun's light will not be obstructed. But producing energy is not the only part of a sustainable city. That's where stage two comes in. Implementing flying cars. What do you mean? We will improve infrastructure to the point that owning a car won't be necessary. Pushing the citizens of the city to use our services to rent a car instead of buying a car. And the space that has been cleared out on roofs of buildings from removing solar panels can provide free parking space. Oh, and that will actually decrease the amount of parked cars on the ground. This will abolish the need for wide roads, which will make, make cities more compact and will create small communities. In turn, decreasing distances between surface facilities like hospitals, shopping centers, and most importantly, schools, making them more accessible to the citizens of the city. That's right. More accessible schools will increase the education among the people. This will increase the number of high-paying jobs, which will decrease unemployment. This will tackle most of the problems that many modern cities currently have, which will create a better and more sustainable living environment for generations to come. 